anything that you want to become amazing at eventually become totally okay being bad at that itself for a little while it takes a lot of effort to appear effortless it is something i have very consciously practiced it is something that i don't let my mind wander Gargi Arya how can i be confident like you in my insta live gargi my sweetheart my 14 15 year old lovely lovely gorgeous girl one of the things i want to tell let you know is that anything that you want to be good at eventually you should be okay being bad at for a while i'm going to repeat that anything that you want to become amazing at eventually become totally okay being bad at that itself for a little while so the first time i did my insta live didn't know anything did not know how it works i don't know how to switch it on i remember 26 people had come for the live i was like 26 people wow uh trying to read the questions not you know able to keep the flow all of that happens to all of us right and then slowly slowly 26 became 36 36 became 46 46 became and today they are almost close to 200 people normally in the room yeah so gargi one of the things i think very important to start to understand is that practice is what's going to take you is going to fill up the gap of your expectation and of your delivery we have an expectation but we don't match our expectation when we deliver right in the beginning and as we keep doing it keep doing it keep doing it keep doing it practicing 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 a day comes where people look at you and go wow she's naturally so amazing nothing is natural everything is you have put in a lot of effort to look effortless everybody write this down it takes a lot of effort to appear effortless so if you are seeing someone do something effortlessly just know a lot of hard work went into behind that yeah asprasad please tell us about eye contact during conversation hmm very beautiful questions virat very 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 important okay why why is eye contact important eye contact tells the other person that you are completely present with them the only time in my coaching session i will remove my eyes from my client will be the time when i need to see the time which also i very strategically place the clock behind my client's uh, head in my office okay so i'll just do this i can see the clock and then i'll come back that's the only time i actually remove my eyes i like to give 100% of my being present with my client and the way a client knows that you're being 100% present is your eyeballs are looking at them remember for any other thought we have to take our eyes off the client to go into any other place right so very important is that you practice this today if you, somebody had to ask me pooja what makes you a fabulous coach if i had to give top 3 things my number in my top 3 one of them would be my ability to keep my mind with my client the entire time that i'm with them it is something i have very consciously practiced it is something that i don't let my mind wander and that comes with when you learn to practice meditation when you learn to practice taming of your mind when you learn to increase your focus and concentration it is extremely helpful because you know what people when they feel heard there is therapy happening there and then i don't even need to know half of my client's solutions they will come up with their own solution the only thing i need to do is hold space for them and in holding space eye contact is the most beautiful gift you can give to your family to your friends to your clients to anybody so start to practice this a lot more just the quality of your question is so beautiful thank you for asking